my channel Shogal Tabi and I'm back with another exciting video. So thank you Kona. So if you're new to my channel, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And if you're old, what it do? Welcome back, Changelings. Thank you very much for liking, commenting, sharing, disliking, commenting, and subscribing, and all the amazing stuff. Anyway, today I'm back with another story time, and you know this story time is part of the story times that really bore me. Okay, like I am not mad, I am not angry, I am just like. This is boring, okay? We are adults. It's boring. Bruh. So anyway, a while ago, if you are have been following me and my stories, you will know last year was just a pit when it comes to my relationships. It was just crazy. It was just cringeworthy. It was just like, ah! Whew. It was weird. So I decided, okay, you know what? I'm just going to get myself something, something, nothing serious, just some fun, you know? just to keep time moving you get it okay. if you don't get it forget about it so um last year i had just uh gone out of a very very messy relationship uh it was crazy if you if you know you know okay we are just not going to go back into that but if you know you know and i decided you know what i just want to have fun on the side i don't want anything intimate i, I, like, I don't want anything that's going to require me to um put my feelings in it or get some strings attached or me having to put in any commitment right so this was just supposed to be something that was just gonna be fun and uh you know we, we, we just do what we gotta do as adults all right so last year around, I think it was August, September, if I'm not lying, um, I go on um, a dating site shopping spree. Why do I call it a shopping spree? But it's just a dating site, okay? I get there and um, I'm just swiping and swiping and swiping and swiping. Then, boom, I come across this baby boy. Hello, motherfucker. <laughs> And we are talking with baby boy and he's asking me, hey, what are you looking for here? And I'm just like, hey, I'm not looking for anything serious. I'm just chilled. And um, yeah, I'm just looking for someone who is willing to share the same sentiments as me, you know? And then he's like, oh, okay, well, I'm actually looking for the same thing. I am just looking for fun. I am not looking for anything serious and stuff like that. So I asked him, okay, what is the reason for you to not want anything serious um are you going through something are you committed in anything you know and then he's like no i am not going through anything i am not committed in anything i am just out here in them streets having fun dipping and diving you know oh my god wow and i'm like okay cool no problem and then he's asking me like why are you not looking for anything serious you know i'm like okay um i'm currently just going through my own phase you know of stuff i'm dealing with some shit so i really don't want anything that is going to want me to like be in anything committed you know and then he's like okay sure no problem you know okay cool so we talk and 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 in the process of us just talking we have never promised each other anything we have never promised each other relationships we've never promised each other um marriage or something happening we've never promised each other hope okay because the way we started it was just we are just gonna have fun okay so um this thing ended up going wrong because you guys will understand what baby boy did okay all right so we talk and talk and talk and talk and talk then we decide to meet we've met like a few times last year right and then um during those times so mina i'm one person if i'm going through something and i or i am dealing with something that is really really um affecting me in one way or another um i i just don't pay attention to anything else i just want to focus on that and focus on myself okay everything else is just um it's just like an extracurricular activity you know what i'm saying so i th that means i don't talk to you i don't call you i don't send messages i don't do anything unless i need to get something done with you and then i'm out okay and then it is what it is it is what it is it is what it is <laughs> but then um i'm assuming probably i didn't communicate that better from the beginning so i don't know the guy would like um text me call me ask how i'm doing he misses me he, wants, he can't wait to see me and stuff like that you know why 
and to me like i never really took that serious i never took it as as if it means anything i just thought okay this was like someone is just you know trying to keep tabs you know like they're just being kind or whatever so that's how i took it so this one time yeah i am basically talking to baby boy and then he's like can you call me tomorrow and i'm like okay i'm gonna call you but because i was busy with something i forgot and then a day after that um he sent me another message and he was like so what happened with you calling me you know and then i was like oh i was gonna call you know one thing about me guys i like explaining and every time i explain it's either i get blocked or i get deleted okay <laughs> if you know you know so okay yeah. Fast forward, I am trying to explain to baby boy why I didn't text, you know, because I'm like, I did, I, I, I honestly, I, I didn't feel like I had to text or, 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 or call back or do anything. So, okay, I can, baby boy, oh, so I'm, I'm trying to explain like, okay, I was gonna call, you know, I just got held, held up by something. And then I send a message, yo! Baby boy deleted me, okay? Make <laughs> okay, I didn't pay a fuss about that, but I was just like, yo, like, why are you mad? You know, like, I, 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 I couldn't understand why he was mad because, I mean, you were just supposed to tell me, like, yo, bro, listen, fuck it. I can't do this anymore or something came up or whatever and then that's just it, you know? Not just delete me and act like I did something wrong to you, okay? All right, chap, okay. Um, I don't ask him anything. I just move on with my life and I'm like, it is what it is. It is what it is. It is, it is what it is. <laughs> I had even forgotten about this dude, okay? And then earlier this year, I go to a party. I get to this party. Zoom! I see baby boy. And I'm like, well, well, well. Surprise, motherfucker. Okay. So baby boy is like, hey. How are you? I haven't seen you in a long time. What's up? I'm like, yeah, I'm good. You deleted me. What happened? You know? And then he's like, no, listen, I'm going to talk to you tomorrow. We can fix this. And I'm like, oh, okay, sharp, whatever. I continue having fun. You know, it is what it is. And um, I get back to my place. For real, for real, you know, baby boy keeps his promise, he comes back, texts me, like, he sends me a message, you know, and then he's like, listen, bro, um, we gotta talk, okay, uh, we get on a call, we talk, we talk, we talk, then we are back to our normal state, okay, I get sharp, so, me and I get no baby boy, uh, we are planning to meet, okay, because, uh, we last saw each other last year, and I have nothing going on in my life, you know, whippy. And then I'm like, okay, Shabu, you know, we are going to meet in, on this day, wada, 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 wada. Okay, things ended up not happening. So, I, this one time, yeah, I'm talking to a buddy of mine, you know. And I haven't seen this guy in a very, very long time, guys. So, I am talking to this guy. And so, we end up talking about baby boy. But I'm just like talking, you know, like in passing. Then my, 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 my friend is like, wait, who is this guy that you are talking about? Because... You know, you keep talking about this person and I, I, every time you talk about them, you know, I've been meaning to say, I think I know someone that know like that, that is probably the same person that you are talking about, you know, but then the person that you are, that, that I know is actually like has a girlfriend, you know, and then I'm like, has a girlfriend, how? You know, it can't be because I asked this one and he said, no, he doesn't have a girlfriend. And then he's like, um, okay, fine. It is what it is. And then I'm like, wait, let me send you a picture or you can send me a picture of the person that you're talking about, you know? And then he's like, okay, let me look for a picture and I'm going to send it to you. Okay, sharp. I also screen grab a profile picture of this guy from his WeChat and I send it to my guy friend. I'm like, is this the person? My guy friend is also sending me a picture of this guy with the girl okay you are kidding me and then he's like this is the same guy and i'm here looking and i'm like wait yeah this is the same guy what the fuck is going on here okay 
In my mind, I'm thinking when he's saying he has a girlfriend, probably he means someone that he's having fun with, okay? Like, I cannot be mad about stuff like that because, I mean, it is what it is, all right? So the guy is like, this girl is so-and-so, okay? And from what I know, like, their relationship is known and, like, it's straight sake, you know? Like, they are together. I know. I know. And then I'm here like, mm, Okay, and then he says, you can go on this girl's Facebook and you can see, like, they are together, you know? Okay, and I'm like, okay, fine. It doesn't hurt to try and go and look for whatever, you know, just to... Because now I'm like, what the fuck is going on here, okay? Like, I understand it's one thing with you um, being with someone that you are having fun with. It's another thing being in a committed relationship and you don't tell me about it. Bro, I don't do shit like that, okay? I don't, I, I don't do stuff like that. So that's why. I, uh, I go on the girl's um, Facebook and oh, I see the picture. But now the picture is like from, yo, some time back, you know? And I'm like, uh, maybe it's not the girlfriend, you know? So at this time when I'm busy doing this, I'm still talking to my buddy, you know? And I'm like, no, I don't think it's the... Then when I'm busy scrolling and I see a picture of a dog... Being held by the girl, and this dog is the dog that the guy has, you know? <laughs> then I'm like to my friend, no, um, listen, I think this is a confusion, you know, because this guy told me that uh, he has a dog and his dog is being taken care of by the cousin. Maybe this is the cousin. Like, bro, I'm not even reading this too deep. I'm like, maybe this is the cousin, you know? Little did I know! Up. then my friend is like okay maybe it is the cousin i don't know but to me i don't think that's a fucking cousin bro okay i'm like okay it's fine i'm gonna ask him about it you know because one thing is you're not gonna put me in situ in sticky and messy situations like those without me knowing okay i i, I really appreciate it especially because we are not in anything committed we are not in it's not like you promised to marry me or you said you wanted to be with me so you didn't owe me any loyalty the only thing you have to do is tell me listen baby girl i'm actually in a committed relationship so that i tell you if you want to disrespect your girlfriend go and do that on your own find someone to do that with don't include me okay so i get um when i'm when this is all happening right i'm drunk i don't know why when i'm drunk i just do the most I just do the most, the most, the most. Oh. Anyway, I get, I text baby boy. I'm like, yo, hey, how are you? He's like, I'm good. I'm like, do you know a girl by so and so? And then he says, I actually know a lot of people by that name. Who are you talking about? Really, nigga? And then I'm like, I'm gonna try and be more specific, okay? Get this right. I send him a picture and I'm like, this is the girl I'm asking about. And then it's like, oh, where did you get the picture from? And I'm like, no, I'm just asking, you know, where I got the picture is not supposed to matter at this point. And then it's like, okay, so if you feel like you're not going to tell me where you got the picture from, then fine. I'm not going to explain myself to you. And I'm like, say what? Okay. Then I'm like, all right. So you are not going to tell me who this girl is. And then it's like, Listen, this is someone that I dated two years ago, and, um, oh, this is someone that I dated for two years. And then I'm like, dated or dating? And then he's like, listen, I was going to explain the whole thing to you when I tell you, you know, some things are not for the phone, and I, 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 I now I don't know what to say. And I'm like, just say what you want to say. Then he keeps quiet. Then he says, no, listen. Firstly, I feel like I didn't owe, I, I felt like I didn't owe you uh, an explanation, you know, because you and I are not in anything exclusive. That's okay. My God. You are damn right. You didn't owe me an explanation. You owed me to tell me that you are in a two-year relationship. Like, bro, like, do you understand what you just did? I'm like, do you, the last time someone put me in a situation like this, they were married. I, I don't understand. I don't understand. 
Maybe he thought I was one of those people who are like, no, bro, because we are just fucking, I don't care. We can fuck behind your girlfriend. I, no, no, don't disrespect me like that, okay? I don't like being put in situations like those. I don't play with females' emotions. Like, I respect women, okay? And by me respecting women, it doesn't, it, it has got nothing to do with the guy, you know? But it's got that, everything to do with what I believe in. Okay, I don't mess around with people in married in who are married or in committed relationships. I, I don't do that. So that really pissed me off. So in the process of me talking to him, right? I am assuming he got scared and he thought, oh my god, she got the picture so so she could have asked the girl or she's going to ask the girl. I don't know. Hey. <laughs> So I am on my Instagram, means, meanwhile talking to this guy, I'm on my Instagram and I see a, an inbox from the girl, right? His girlfriend. And then she's like, I heard you were talking, hey, I heard you were asking about me. Why? And then in my mind, you know, because I'm drunk, I am thinking, uh, you are kidding me. What are the odds? Am I seeing things or is this really happening okay so um the guy went i'm not sure if he went to tell the girl or he went to, i don't even know what he went to do okay but all i know is he wanted to cover his ass I, <laughs> that guy is messy i know he doesn't know that i have a youtube channel but if you know that i have a youtube channel and you watch this you are messy and I'm, you are messy oh my god Like, I don't understand. What are you afraid of? I I am talking to you. As someone that put me in this situation, you are an adult. You're just supposed to tell the truth. No one is going to hit you. I don't know. I just don't understand people who just do weird stuff for no reason. Okay? Okay, fine. Get back to the story again. Hi, yeah. So, I, I, I'm, I, I'm like to the girl. Also, I see the message and I'm like, uh. So, I reply to the girl. I'm like, who said I was asking about you? You know? And then she's like, who are you asking about me from? And then I'm like, no, I was actually asking so-and-so, I say her boyfriend's name, about you because they told me that, because he told me that you are his girlfriend. But um, I've, I heard from someone that, I mean, that you are his cousin. Why so single? But I heard from someone that you are his girlfriend, right? And then, guys, honestly, that was really messy of me. I was, I, I feel like I wasn't supposed to say that to her because, um, this was between me and the guy but then i was just like okay you started this you ran to her that's your problem you will sort it out bitch okay okay shop so she's like to me um no i am not his cousin and um if you have any questions just go and ask him and in my mind i'm like okay um this is actually not going the way it's supposed to go because i'm not even supposed to be talking to this person i am supposed to be talking to this one okay so I'm like, okay, no, no problem. Then she's asking me, who told you that I am his girlfriend? Like, who, who did you hear about me from? And then I, I said I heard from my friend, okay? And I said my friend's name, which was actually not true because I didn't hear that from my friend. I actually heard it from my other friend, you know, uh, my guy friend. And um, that was really wrong of me to say it. And... Uh, <clears throat> She was like, oh, okay, no, I don't even know who you're talking about, so it's okay. You can continue asking him about it. And I was like, okay, cool. So, this guy, he hears that I am actually um, still talking to the girl. And then he's like, I told you to block this girl. You are still continuing to talk to him? So you are still continuing to talk to her? Fine, just don't talk to me again. Then he hangs up! <laughs> right now why are you angry why are you angry hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. okay fast forward again i uh we block each other i mean she might get mad you know so when i get mad i start saying some weird stuff to the guy like i called him out of his name because i was really mad like why would you want to put me in a situation like that especially because you are even saying it yourself we don't owe each other explanations 
but we owe each other the truth. You are not scared of me. You didn't promise me anything. I am not scared of you. You, I didn't promise you anything. Like, boyfriends are not going to put me in a situation like this. And booty calls get to put me in a situation like this. No. Hell no, no. To the no, no. If this is how entanglements are supposed to work, then guess what? They are boring. And I don't want to be a part of them. Well, I stop being a part of them. Right now, I feel like God. God, whatever you are trying to teach me, I, I, I get it. Okay? Just... Just, just make it happen this year. Just make it happen this year. Anyway, back to the story. I get so. Okay, the next day I wake up, I have a hangover, and I, I don't remember half of the things that happened. Okay, like guys, you know, this is a story for another day. But I get, I, I, I see you good. Okay, sharp. When I was angry, I said some fucked up things to him. You know, especially because I, you know, now it's like. I was just trying to be messy and stuff like that, you know. Yes, I have every right to be mad for what you did. But I feel like some of the things that I said, <laughs> that was wrong. Because I'm not that messy. I mean, if we have an agreement, we have an agreement. I respect you, you respect me, and that's it, you know. I guess up. Okay, so, oh, baby boy, again. Oh, I sent him a message, and I'm like, listen, bro. I'm sorry for the way I handled some of the things that happened yesterday. And, um... I am still mad though about what you did because I feel like you didn't have the right to do what you did. Um, I hope you managed to fix things with your partner. Mina, deuces. I don't want anything to do with this. You can keep your shit going on. Just move on, okay? And then he sends me a message and he's like, oh, so you're gonna blame this on the alcohol? And I'm like, no, this is not about me blaming anything on the alcohol. I'm just saying, like, this shit is just not gonna work, okay? If you wanna disrespect your girl, do it with someone else. I have never one of the reason I one of the reasons why I asked you from the beginning is because if you had told me that you are in a in a relationship, then I was just gonna leave, you know? I wasn't gonna entertain you, even if it was just for fun. No, I am not gonna do that. To me, my explanation of fun. And then he says, no, at that time, you know me and my relationship, I'm always on and off. Hey, what kind of is that? So I'm like, okay, you were on it. Maybe at that time you felt like you were off, but when you were on, you didn't, you didn't think of telling me that you were on. Make that make sense to me. Make that make sense to me. That is not explanation enough. That is not an excuse enough. So in my eyes, you are just useless. Get on. Get the fuck on. I get, and then he's like, okay, so um, I just want you to know that what you did yesterday really pissed me off. I was not impressed. And now that shows that I made the right decisions when it came to you. Hold up. What are you talking about? Right decisions that you made to me. When it came to me. What's <laughs> You made these decisions on your own. You are not going to act like the fucking prize right now. Okay? I just told you. It's done. Leave me alone. Go and do what you want to do with your... Like, honestly, I just don't like it when people... You know, guys. I just don't like when people put me in situations where now I have to be the home wrecker, the house wrecker, the relationship wrecker. Ah, uh -uh, those things piss me off. Okay? Even if we are booty calling, just don't do, don't. <sighs> it's okay, Tabi. It's okay. So, you know, that really pissed me off. Honestly, it bored me. Like, I, I really got bored. And I was just like, okay, you know what? I tried relationships that didn't work. I tried booty calls that didn't work. So, you know what? This thing just ain't working, okay? Um, Yeah. But guys, was I wrong? I don't think I was wrong. Like, that guy did me wrong, okay? He did me fucking wrong. And I, 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 I'm not impressed. I am really, really not fucking impressed. But it is what it is. If it ain't, then it wasn't it all the way from China. Thank you guys for watching. Yes, it. <laughs> Bye.